Hi, I'm Jim Hilliard. I'm one of the deanery and diocesan representatives for St. Thomas Church in White Marsh, and I wanted to share a few ways that I'm trying to stay connected during this time that we need to keep our distance from one another physically and try to find ways to become closer to one another spiritually. The first thing I want to show you is the diocesan website. The bishop has been posting daily updates and uh, information about how the diocese is responding to the current crisis and also providing moments of meditation and prayer available for us all through his Facebook page and other media. The second thing that I want to point out is that I'm becoming uh, more and more aware of the Book of Common Prayer, using it more diligently and more intentionally during my daily prayer and worship. The Book of Common Prayer is what brought me to the Episcopal Church and it's important and valuable for me to reconnect with those origins as I use my own Book of Common Prayer copy as well as my 1928 Book of Common Prayer that was given to me by, by my brother-in-law. In addition, it's an opportunity for me to look at other sources uh, using this website, justice.anglican.org, which gives me examples of Books of Common Prayer that are used in other parts of the Anglican Communion, as well as historical volumes of the Book of Common Prayer. Taking advantage of all of these resources, including daily emails from the diocese and from the bishop, the daily staying connected videos that the church is putting out and using the Book of Common Prayer more intentionally is helping me to maintain my sanity and my ability to connect with other people during a time when we cannot see each other face to face.